Hello, Sash Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Nati. So, I will be hopping right into y'all energy. I want you all to take what fits, leave what does not. If anything does resonate with you, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Squat rules is needed. Also, Sash Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love, likes, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank you for everything that you have been doing in Hell and Channel, girl. I really love and appreciate you all. Now, I know I said I wasn't going to be posting today, but I can't stay away from you guys for too long. So, I'm here, honey. All right, I'm going to do one more shuffle. All right, spirit. Energy for Sash. Okay. So... So I feel like y'all are taking a leap of faith here, okay? Um, towards something new. There's something that you have discovered or found out about a King of Pentacles or a Queen of Cups, okay? Uh, so you're choosing to be single and protect your energy from this person. Yeah, there's some sort of awakening here about someone. Okay, maybe you took a leap of faith in love and now you're closing that cup of love when it comes to someone. Okay, um, there's something you found out. There's some sort of awakening here that you're going through when it comes to this person. Love, okay, when it comes to love in general. Um, now, I feel like you're going to have a lot of options in love here once you release yourself. Okay. Um, I feel like whatever love that you had, you're pouring that out, okay? Whatever love you had for this person, um, and you are pouring energy into other things, okay? Or other opportunities for yourself or other people. Yeah, you're completely putting an end to something here with someone. Someone toxic is something that you find out about someone toxic. Okay, uh, you could have found out that this person was toxic. You could have found out that they had obsessions. Uh, they could have had a toxic mindset, traits, or behaviors. So, you're completely done with this individual. You're, you're no longer wasting your time or putting your love or energy into this person. I feel like you are trusted into the universe here, okay? Um, like I said, you're going to have options in love, okay? So, this could be, you could be an emperor or an empress here. Okay, um, now out of the options, everyone is not going to be an emperor or an empress. So you're just going to have to be wise. Uh, you're going to have to be choosy here. Um, now, whoever this person is that you are releasing, they are holding on to your energy still. Um, feeling left out in the cold by you. Maybe there's something about this person's finances as well here. But I just feel like you are starting a new opportunity now this person who you are cutting off they want to reach out to you okay that's the truth sad okay so this person is going to be reaching out to you with some communication um because they're possessive over you they can't let you go um they are getting clarity that you are moving forward maybe that you have options here Okay, um, it's something about this person. Is they could be needy. They could need help financially here. Okay, and you you have big money or you're coming into big money. Um, this could be someone who you have a child with, but I feel like you're happy here. You're using your intuition and taking a leap of faith to cut this person out. Okay, and um, this person could be mad that you're leaving them, okay? Um, I feel like they're in an energy of thinking like, damn, like this person was my happiness. This person helped me out a lot. Um, I've invested some time with this person. Um, they were there for me when I needed them. But it's like, who's going to be there for you? You're there for them, but who's going to be there for you, sir? Who's gonna be there for you? That's the that's the energy like that you're in right now, okay? And I feel like you're gonna be having you're gonna be moving forward here. Alright. 
and you're going to be you're going to be moving towards someone who can be there for you someone who matches you the emperor to the empress or the empress to the emperor okay you're going to be moving or towards something that's really going to make you happy because i feel like you are happy as a single person and it's something that has been revealed about this individual and you're holding back and they are trapped in their head they can't sleep at night for some of these people some of these people really need your help they down to one pinnacle you're the only one that they can call on um in their time of need but you're holding back here you're holding back that communication and they can't take it they really can't take it they really been in their head here uh, when it comes to you sad so you could be a masculine or feminine energy you can be an emperor or an empress you're going to find your match here um I feel like this person had little to give. They were the page of cups, so they barely gave love, and they were the page of pentacles. They barely gave money, okay? And this person don't want you to sacrifice them. They don't want you to continue to hold back on your communication, but I do feel like you're moving forward. You're no longer uh, invested in this person anymore, okay? It's something that you've been enlightened on when it comes to their finances or their job. Okay, this can be a king of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Capricorn, Scorpio, or Pisces energy, okay? Uh, so, yeah, you're, you're moving forward with the wheel. You're walking away here, playing a block up. You, you don't want anything to do with this person. They are extremely heartbroken with this distance here. Okay. It can be something up with their job here. They're heartbroken about their job. They could feel like you're juggling them, like you're putting them in a third-party situation. They can't handle this distance, but you just want someone that's going to be there for you all the way, okay? You want someone stable, um, and this person is just taking too long to give you what you want, to be honest, okay? They are definitely sad here. They feel like they're losing you. Um, they want to reunite with you here. They want to fight off any competition. Maybe they feel like you are reuniting with someone here from your past. Where they just feel like you have competition or options. This could be someone you're married to or someone you were in a long time connection with. Okay. They're getting messages about some secrets you have, maybe when it comes to other people. Maybe that you're really moving forward and ending something with them to be, be with someone more stable. So they're secretly getting messages about you, about what you're doing during this time of distance or not talking, okay? So um, they can't handle the distance that you guys have right now, the non-communication. Um, but like I said, you just want someone that's going to be there for you who really has your back, like you have their back. Like, I feel like it's been maybe like a 70-30. You've been 70. They've been given 30 with the love, the finances, the sex, the time, the attention. You're not getting what you it's not 50 50 okay or 100 100 and you're just not you're not happy in this anymore you could have kept this a secret that you were not happy with this marriage or this long-term commitment but it's being exposed now the, um, the unhappiness is being revealed here um but yeah, if anything resonates with you say, it's give me a like, comment, subscribe to the channel, swap roles if needed, and until next time, bye.